Okay, so my new patio furniture is here. I'm super excited because it's from Akamba. I've been seeing them on Instagram and whatnot, and they were kind enough to send me some beautiful patio furniture. So as you all know, I am in the works of making this space a little bit better. I want it to be a little bit more cozy, especially for the fall months. I love fall, so I really want to do like a really cozy spot out here so we can sit down and just enjoy the outdoor space. So let's transform it from this to something way better. So this is the final look of the patio area. Again, this is from a Conva. I absolutely love this patio set. I think it just makes it so much more cozy and just homey looking. It has a lot more seating than we had before. So we'll be able to host all of our family and friends over and have enough space for everyone to sit down. So loving the color of this these cushions it's like a really nice like beige like grayish beige color which is just really nice it's gonna go with a lot of different decor and things like that so cannot wait to continue to decor this space up fall is coming up so i'm gonna be decorating for fall soon so we do plan on getting like a fire pit for this middle part right here which i think is going to be so nice as well as a tv for the wall as well so that way we can sit outside and really just enjoy this space so yeah again it's from a convo i will link it down below for y'all so y'all can check it out and y'all let me know what y'all think oh i will also have a discount code for you guys down below you can use my code summer blair for eight percent off of your purchase a convo has a lot of different types of furniture in different categories so if you're looking for outdoor furniture indoor furniture definitely check them out they have some really nice stuff so let me know what you guys think down below Okay, so while we were in Houston, we went to Ikea and I picked up these pillows that I always wanted. I just never ordered them. They are 20 by 20 and they were only like $7 or $7.99, something like that, which I think is a steal for these because they're like the down pillows, like the ones you can like chop and make really cute. So I bought five of them to put on my patio. These are not outdoor pillows, so we'll see how it goes. So we'll see if I want to put them there or somewhere else but just want to show you guys these and then I also got these white pillow covers also from Ikea and they're just like a you know regular white pillow so I'm gonna see what these look like on my patio uh, also link them down below these pillow covers I think were like four dollars or something like that so not bad for them and the quality is decent as well Okay, so this is what the pillows look like. I don't like them on the patio furniture. I think they're way too white uh, for the furniture, but I love the actual pillows. So this is the pillow inserts I showed you guys with the pillow covers on them. Uh, they're very nice. If you are looking for like a super white pillow cover, these are great. I'll link them down below if I can find them. Uh, but I'm definitely going to get some more pillow covers. Uh, the size of the pillow is a 20 by 20 and the pillow cover is also a 20 by 20. And see how it's kind of roomy? That's why I typically like to get one size smaller in the cover. 
than the actual pillow is because it kind of makes it have like more of like that full tighter look and this one's more slouchy so if you're going for more of that slouchy look then get the same size pillow cover as the insert but if you want more of like that tight full look I would get a size down in the cover so for example the pillows are 20 by 20 I would get an 18 by 18 pillow cover for this instead of a 20 by 20 like these are but love the pillows I'm gonna go and look for some more pillow covers I'm probably gonna do more of like a beige but I want to like kind of mix it up a little bit as well I don't want it to be just like super neutral out here and of course I want to be able to change it up for the season that's a great that's the great thing about having pillow covers is that you can always change it up for the season so yep I'm gonna go look for some more and of course keep you guys updated on what I find okay guys so I'm super excited because I got this wooden travel map in the mail today from enjoy the wood and I've been seeing this online and I just absolutely love the way it looks so I'm gonna put it on my wall in my office i'm gonna show you where i'm gonna put it but just can't wait to show you guys this because it is the cutest like wall decor and just a cool way to keep up with where you've been traveling so i'm gonna go ahead and unbox it and show y'all what's in it Okay, so I was gonna put it up myself, but I waited till Jared got off of work so we can kind of make it like a fun little date night. So I'm excited to spend a little bit of time together putting together this map on this wall. So this is currently what the wall looks like. We're gonna put it on this wall right here in my office space. I don't have plans for the wall space in here. So I think that map is gonna be a perfect addition, especially with the new desk. I just think all like the wood aspects are going to really make this a nice warm and cozy office space. So yeah, so we're gonna put on this wall. Right now we are working on putting the map together. So let's go ahead and see what's going on. So we're going to put the pieces on the table at first just to see if we have all the pieces. We're gonna take inventory and make sure we put them in the right spot. So this is the map that it came with. So we are going to put all the pieces together and then take it to the room. So Jared's just putting the map together on the table before we put it on the wall. The pieces are just so gorgeous. They are really nice, like neutral, natural wood color. I'm in the back cooking. I just really enjoy us spending all this time uh, getting the house together. I love how involved he is with it. It just makes it so much more fun when we're doing it together. So this is what the map looks like as a whole. So let's go ahead and put it on the wall. Side note, this was super fun to put together. We learned so much about different countries. We even learned about countries that we didn't even know existed. So it was really fun to see all of the countries come together, where they were, places we want to go. And we were actually looking things up on Google, just seeing what places look like. And the world is so big and beautiful. So I'm super happy that we got to do this because it was just so cool to see everything come together. Okay guys, so this is the final look of the map. It is just so gorgeous. It really added a whole new look to my wall space. Like it really does no justice how beautiful this map really truly is. 
like all the countries are on here like all the little details it's just so 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 gorgeous i love this the colors are just so beautiful so this is from enjoy the wood i will link it down below for you guys so y'all can check it out it comes in different sizes as well this is the large size on my wall so it takes up a really good bit of the wall which i really like a lot it just really adds a nice look to my office space so yeah i'll keep you guys updated on what i add to this office space because it is currently in makeover mode but i think this map was in excellent choice also some options you can get to add to your map so this is the flag pins that you can get which i think are just so cool so you can pin where you've been um, on the map so they have a bunch of countries and also states as well super vibrant super colorful just a really cool way to keep up with your travels. You can also do the plain push pins as well, which I prefer. I think these are just so like aesthetically pleasing. Since they're white, they kind of go with my decor aesthetic more than the pins, but the pins are really cool as well. So just some cute little accessories to add to your map to document your travels. Love it, love it. They are available on the Enjoy the Wood website as well. So make sure you check them out. They're just a really cool touch. So this is what the paper planes look like on the map. I think these are just so aesthetic and cute. They're just like some little push pins and me and Jared just kind of put where we've been. So yeah, see how there's like a little hole there. I thought that was like super cute. Uh, we haven't been many places. As you can see, this side of the map is just plain. There's nothing on this side because we have not been anywhere, but in the USA, we've been to a couple of different states, and this is not together. This is just summer, summer together trips, summer just trips that we've had on our own. Um, but yeah, the furthest I've been is Costa Rica, which I love Costa Rica. Costa Rica is so beautiful. Um, but yeah, everywhere I've traveled, I've really enjoyed and loved. Arizona was another great place that I love to visit. Uh, Florida, of course, Texas, just really just beautiful fun places. Mexico, also a beautiful place as well. We went to Tulum last year, which was a great trip. We also just booked our honeymoon, so we will soon have a, a plane over here in Turks and Caicos, which I'm super excited about. So let me know how Turks and Caicos is if you've ever been, any travel tips, all that good stuff in the comments. But yeah, guys, this is all the places we've been. So we have a lot more planes in our box to add to this map. And this is just going to encourage us to keep traveling. I will link the map down below for you guys in the description box. Y'all can check it out. And thank you so much to Enjoy the Wood for sending this over. So yeah, this is the end of the video. Let me know what you guys think. And until next time, I will see you guys later.